Zippity doo dah Beautiful day, great to be alive. Hey, what's up everyone? This is Chris Brown here again. Now, as you can see behind me, I'm still hanging out here at the Yacht Beach Club Resort here in Walt Disney World. Now, if you did not have to work 40 hours a week, what would you do with your time? What do you enjoy doing in your free time? Do you have a favorite TV show? Now, perhaps as a way to become self-sufficient, you could start a fan site or a blog dedicated to one of your favorite TV shows. Do you like sports or have a favorite sports team? So perhaps you could start a blog uh, reviewing some of the games, maybe talking about some of the highlights, pretty much something similar to like what Sports Center does. Do you like taking nature walks? Do you have a pet? Um, animals, things of that sort. So what you could do here is a way to become self-sufficient. You might want to take pictures of them, film some videos, uh, and post those pictures and videos on your blog, and that would be a way for you to become self-sufficient. Do you have a favorite vacation destination? Again, I'm here in Walt Disney World. Uh, so if you have a favorite vacation destination, you could film videos, you could take pictures, you could uh, write articles, put some tips on that, and then you could post that on your blog. And that would be a way for you to attempt to become self-sufficient. Now because of the stimulus program, not only will the government add three to $500 per month added onto your paycheck from your job through this series of governmental stimulus programs or bailout programs, they will also help you to support your lifestyle. So my travels to Disney World is 100% tax deductible. Now I do live here now, but uh, so I have a season pass. So that is 100% tax deductible. Any food that I have here while I'm filming these videos here for you today, uh, the iPad that I'm filming this video on, all of these things are tax deductible. And so the, the government is helping to finance this stuff and, and pay for it for me. Uh, so again, uh, because of this bailout program, not only will you get to three to five hundred dollars per month added onto your paycheck through a series of governmental stimulus programs, but you'll also save anywhere on average from about two thousand to about ten thousand dollars per year just on your normal everyday expenses. My friend Marco, who is working for a landscaping business now, even before I even heard about this stimulus program, he lost his job, and while he was looking for another job, he started attempting to become self-sufficient through blogging. So he's blogging about some of the different entertainment events going on in Hollywood, Beverly Hills area. But within about three weeks, Capitol Records contacted him and hired him. So as he was attempting to become self-sufficient, uh, not only would he have qualified for this government bailout program if he would have known about it, but it also helped him to land his dream job. And so they sent him out to the different entertainment events going around in the Hollywood, uh, Beverly Hills, Los Angeles area. They uh, sent him to concerts, paid for all of the expenses, hooked him up with the right people. That way he could get his connections. That way he could... He basically was a, a, you know, a, an on-site reporter pretty much. And so because of attempting to become self-sufficient, like I said, he landed his dream job. Now imagine yourself doing this. Imagine if you did the exact same things that Marco did where he was able to land his dream job at Capitol Records within about three weeks but what is your dream job and imagine how excited you would be as you were attempting to become self-sufficient if you landed your dream job now we've all heard it takes money to make money right so instead of spending the hundreds or maybe even thousands of dollars that uh, normally people say that it takes to be to attempt to become self-sufficient we suggest not to spend any more than it would take to, to let's say take your family out on an evening out on the town maybe to some of your favorite restaurants however this is not about spending money it's about saving money because again if you do not get yourself qualified for this governmental stimulus programs not only will you not receive the three to five hundred dollars per month added onto your paycheck from your job but the two to ten thousand dollars every year that you could be saving you'll have to spend that so if you do not get yourself qualified for this governmental stimulus program and get it started here with us today, you will lose at least five to $10,000 this year. And so this is why we suggest anytime you're attempted to become self-sufficient when you're getting started, the first thing that we suggest is get started with blogging. Number one, it has a very low investment, but you're also not tied down to anything. What I mean by that is by blogging, you're pretty much free to do pretty much anything that you want. Now let's say that you've been attempted to become self-sufficient for some time. Well, by using blogs and by blogging, that will further that enterprise. Uh, let's say that you're just getting started in something brand new. So again, we suggest blogs. So you might have a hobby or things that you're interested in. Uh, as opposed to some of the other things that people do to become self-sufficient is they're really tied down into something. You know, it's very limited. Let's say that they hear of a, of, a, of a great income opportunity for them and so they just get tied into that. Uh, let's say it's, it's fitness. And so they, everything that, that they're, they're 
uh, they're doing is tied within the fitness industry. However, if they're blogging, they can really do pretty much anything that they want to do. So I have a blog about Disney tips and Disney travel. I have a, a pretty much a men's health guide, um, a, a business blog. There's a number of different blogs that I use, and that way I can get into uh, multiple different categories and just uh, explore my passions, things that I really enjoy as opposed to just doing something just to make money with. Now at this point, I know some of you might not even know what a blog is. Others of you may be concerned that you don't know how to blog. You may be concerned that you're not that good with technology. You may uh, not be the most greatest speller in the world. And so these are all issues that we'll address. Now first of all, if you can write an email, you can write a blog. It takes the same type of skill level to write a blog as it does to email. Uh, in fact, the very same tool that you use to write your emails, well that's also in the blogging systems. So if you could write an email, you can do the exact same things that Markle did to become self-sufficient that landed him his dream job. Now again, some of you may be concerned that you're not the greatest speller in the world or you don't know how to write. Don't worry about this. So in no way am I the greatest writer or speller in the world. So people look at me, if this guy can become a successful blogger, surely then I can do it. So don't even worry about being successful at this because even if you fail, in fact, I want you to fail because even if you do fail, the government will still add three to $500 per month added onto your paycheck from your job through a series of governmental stimulus programs. Plus, you'll save the $2,000 to $10,000 on your normal everyday expenses. Where can you go and get paid $3,600 a year to $6,000 a year if you fail? Now, remember the movie The Field of Dreams? If you build it, they will come. Well, the internet and blogging is just like that. So if you blog, traffic will come, people will come to your blog, and eventually you will be successful. Now, on my journey to becoming self-sufficient, I developed the skills where I could get hired as a business consultant for a $400 million marketing firm without a college education. Now, while I was at that company, my clients ranged from small mom and pop shops all the way to executives from Fortune 500 companies who paid an average of about fifteen to about $25,000 for a series of one-on-one -on -one coaching sessions with me. So this proves that I'm more than qualified to help you to become self-sufficient. Now, we're not the only game in town. So this requires us to do more for you in order to earn your trust and faith that we can do the job for you. Now, like I said, the internet is like the field of dreams. If you build it, they will come. So if you blog, they will come. Google needs your help. Google is looking for volunteers to create articles, uh, pictures, videos, uh, audio programs that are called as podcasts. And so people who come and search Google will click on those ads and thus Google will get paid. So if it wasn't for people like us creating blogs, creating articles, creating videos, creating audio programs, creating podcasts, if it wasn't for people like us, Google would not have a way to make money based upon their current business model. So they need us. So Google has essentially said if we blog, if we create articles, if we create pictures, if we film videos, if we do podcasts, if we do audio programs, they will send us traffic. And from that traffic, we can decide how we want to make money with it, even if we don't have anything to sell. Now, Instagram is basically a broken business. And Facebook bought Instagram for a billion dollars. Uh, had no ways to generate money, but it was because of the traffic. So at this point, it doesn't even matter if you know what you're, how you're going to make money with it. You want to focus, number one, on getting traffic. And the way we get traffic is by creating content, the articles, the videos, the pictures, uh, audio programs, things of that sort. And so we're attempting to become self-sufficient. And again, if we do that, the government will add three to $500 per month added onto our paycheck from our job through a series of governmental stimulus programs, right? Uh, plus, we'll also save anywhere from about $2,000 to about $10,000. Uh, per year on our normal everyday expenses. Then later on, we can do what is called as monetizing that traffic, meaning with that traffic that Google and the search engines are sending us, how are we going to make money with it? And so we'll decide that at a later point. That's uh, as it were putting the, the, the carriage before the horse. So at this point, we just want to focus on those things that's just going to generate us traffic. And again, that's how we're going to qualify ourselves for this governmental stimulus program. Now again, the internet is like the field of dreams. If you build it, they will come. So if we create enough blog articles, if we 
film enough videos, if we do enough podcasts, if we take enough pictures, if we post them on our blogs, then Google and search engines are going to send us enough traffic. So we're going to have to create enough of that content. Again, filming the videos, taking the pictures, writing the articles, doing the podcast. We're going to have to do enough of that so that Google and the search engines will say will send us enough traffic to be able to replace our income. So let's look at some successful bloggers. Now this is johnchild.com, one of the world's leading bloggers. Now if you would search Google for the world's top bloggers, John Child would come up. Now one of the things that he has said is if you blog once a day for a year, you will replace your job. So the question is, how fast do you want to replace the income from your job? Now if you want to do it in a year, you need to blog once a day. If you want to do it in six months, you need to blog twice a day. If you want to do it in 90 days, you want to blog four times a day. If you want to do it, let's say in 45 days, you need to blog eight times a day. So it just really depends how fast you want to do it. Now, in the meantime, the government will still add three to $500 per month added onto your paycheck through your job through a series of stimulus programs. And you have up to three years to become successful. Otherwise, they will consider it a hobby. Now, in my case, I made 100 blog posts which turned into 10,000 visitors to my blog on average a day and averaging 500 leads per day. My first blog was a Disney blog. Um, when me and my wife lived out in Los Angeles, we'd go to Disneyland. We had a season pass for Disneyland. Uh, I'd film videos of the rides, I'd take pictures of it, and then post it on my blog. Uh, after doing that for about six months, though, I had enough traffic and I had a, a gentleman who ran a Disney travel agency. And so he contacted me, asked me to sell him his my blog to him originally I said no um, but once he told me how much the price was then it, it, it was one of, like one of those offers a price that I could not refuse because I thought well I can always rebuild and I can build another one which I have done now the internet is like the movie the field of dreams if you build it they will come but it's also a popularity contest the more popular you are online the more traffic that Google and the search engines will send to you now a blog is a website, but a blog is a particular type of website. And so when people have a website or businesses have a website, many times they wonder why they also need a blog. Now imagine your website as a salesperson, okay? So the reason that you want to have a blog is because a blog generates traffic. And from your blog or from the traffic from that blog, you send that to your website, which is your salesperson. Now uh, ideally what you want to use is you want to use an auto sales closing system, a smart website, a squeeze page, it goes by dip many different terms. Most of the websites that most companies have, or at least small companies, small medium sized businesses, if you're looking at something like that, they just have a website that's basically a postcard. You need to have a website that actually does the selling for you. So your blog generates traffic, that traffic, you send that to your website, your squeeze page, your auto sales closing system, and that's what does the selling for you. So even if you do have a website, chances are if you don't have a blog, you're not that popular online. Here's how this works. What do these three people have in common? A doctor, a psychiatrist, and a homemaker. Now just like your website, at one time these people were unpopular. And so what happened though, is somebody who was popular, Oprah Winfrey, who was pretty much like a blog, partnered up and befriended these individuals and thus Dr. Oz, Dr. Phil, and Rachel Ray all became popular by association. So we too want to become popular by association and again one of the ways that we do this is through blogging. Now not all blogs are created equal. Now this website that you see in front of you it's Alexa.com which is a sister company of Amazon. And what this website does is it ranks some of the most popular websites out there on the internet and that way we can become popular by association. So as you can see here, this blogging platform called WordPress uh, on a global level is the number th 35th most popular website on the internet in the entire world and the number 38th most popular website just here in the United States. So what we suggest you to use is number one use a blog and number two use a WordPress blog so if you get a blog with WordPress you will become popular by association now the reason I sold my Disney blog is because I used WordPress and it wasn't just any blog I used WordPress and so I thus became popular by association
With my current WordPress blog, I'm averaging about 10,000 visitors per day. Now, WordPress does have a free version. However, in order to qualify for this governmental stimulus program, you have to attempt to become self-sufficient. So with a free version, you're very limited in what you can do with it. A lot of the things that you're going to need to do to attempt to make money to qualify yourself for this governmental stimulus program is just not available with the free version. So let's look at how we're going to make money with your blog. Now let's first look at ad revenue. So if you would come over here to Google and you have these ads on the side of the website, right? And so what you could do is you could take those ads, place it on, on your blog, and anytime somebody clicks on those ads, you would get paid and they don't even have to buy anything and you would still get paid from it. Now, there's a website called Ask the Builder and it's run by a gentleman by the name of Tim Carter who is a handyman. And according to the Google website, it says that Tim Carter is earning an extra $30,000 per month from his blog. So as a handyman, how does a handyman have enough hours in his day to make an extra $30,000 per month? He doesn't. However, what he does know is how much he is generating based on the amount of content that he has created on his blog. There's a thing that is called as an earning per click. He knows exactly how much they're earning for every person who comes to his website. So based because he knows that, he now knows how many blog, much content he has to put on his blog for Google and the search engines to send him enough traffic in order for him to make $30,000 per month. So as you come over here, as you can see here, if we look on the side of his blog, um, as you can see here, here's some ads from, uh, that one's from, from HostGator, and then you got some more down here, and you have just different ads that come up. And like I said, anytime somebody clicks on those ads, he gets paid, and they don't even have to buy anything, and he still gets paid from it. Well, that's the first area. There's a couple, a number of different websites that you can use that that uh, will give you some ad revenue like what we're showing here with Google. Google obviously is the most popular one, but there's a lot of other uh, websites that you can generate ad revenue through your blog as well. Now the next area that we want to look at, which is a thing that is called affiliate programs. Basically, it just gives you the rights to be able to sell other people's products. And this is especially great for you, uh, for those of you who don't have a product of your own. Now, you don't have to spend any money to join any affiliate programs. Affiliate programs are, are free. And what they will do is if you look at companies like Amazon, eBay, obviously there's, there's hundreds of thousands of other companies that do this as well. And what they will do is they will provide you with, with different links. And when we put those links on our blog and somebody clicks on those links and buys, we would get paid. Now, as you notice, I said in this case, they actually have to buy in order to get paid. Um, this is not ad revenue. This is you're, you're getting paid because you're referring a sale to another company. Now, in the case of Amazon and eBay, I, I do want to clarify something. This is not this is not you taking products and putting products on Amazon and eBay and, and selling them. Up. But what you're doing is you're taking the inventory that is already on Amazon and eBay, putting a link to it from your blog. And again, anytime somebody clicks on those links and buys, you get paid. Now, I really like, like Amazon because of this. Um, let's say that you would put, let's say, uh, just sell something on your blog. Maybe let's say, uh, as an example, just a 99 cents black iPhone cover. Okay, something very, very cheap and inexpensive. Now, the data shows that the average person will come back within about 60 days and spend a total of about $800, but because that you uh, generated that first referral, you're the one who generated the referral, Amazon is still going to pay you. So even though you only sold the black iPhone cover, they're also going to pay you on that eight, extra $800 in revenue because of the affiliate programs. Now, as I mentioned, there's a lot of other different affiliate programs that you can participate in. There's a lot of other type of income streams that you can also participate in that you can put on your blog, but ad revenue and affiliate programs are the best way to start. Say nothing about you know generating the three to $500 per month added onto your paycheck from the series of governmental stimulus programs plus the $2,000 to $10,000 that you'll save on your normal everyday expenses as well. 
Now, I want to bribe you into getting started with us here today because the sooner that you get started with us here, the sooner that you can qualify for this governmental stimulus program. So as soon as you get started with us here today, within about three weeks, you'll start receiving a, that extra three to $500 per month added onto your paycheck from your job through a series of governmental stimulus programs. But as soon as you do this, right away, you're going to be able to start qualifying for that savings of $2,000 to $10,000 every year on your normal everyday expenses. Now, again, if you haven't done so already, I want to encourage you to look down below directly underneath this video and that way you can click on the little button and that way you can go ahead and download all the proper forms that you need to be able to qualify for this governmental stimulus program. So let's just say that you wait another day to put this off before you go ahead and get started. If you do that, you will lose $20 today. If you wait, let's say, another week, you'll lose $100. If you wait, let's say, another month, you'll lose another three to $500 by not qualifying for this governmental stimulus program. Now, if you look over the past year, you have already lost anywhere between $3,600 to $6,000 of, of government of stimulus programs added on the paycheck from your job, uh, not including the two to $10,000 in savings off of your normal everyday expenses. So why wait another day to even lose even more money? Now, whether you get yourself qualified for this governmental stimulus program or not, it is still available to you. So it's your choice. You can decide to let some billion dollar, billionaire CEO use this governmental stimulus program to be able to finance his jet, or you can use your three to $500 per month added onto your paycheck from your job through this series of governmental stimulus programs to be able to help provide for your family. This is not about how much this blog will cost for you to get started. It's about how much you will lose by not getting started with this blog with us here today. So again, if you do not get started with us here today, you will lose $20. You already lost $20 yesterday. If you wait another week, you already lost $100 last week. You already lost three to $500 last month. You already lost $3,600 to $6,000 last year. How much more money are you gonna wait to lose before you go ahead and get started and put this into action? Now, when you get started with us here today, here's what you'll get. Okay, so first of all, you're going to get the blogging system, and this is a picture of me as I was hanging out at Epcot Center and Walt Disney World as the monorail is going by, and that's where I'm doing my blogging. So, uh, as you can see here, what you're going to get is you're going to get access to the WordPress blogging system, where you're going to be able to create articles, post videos, post pictures, uh, post audio programs that are called pos podcasts. You can link it off to some of the different income streams. There's hundreds of different designs that you can use, choose from for your blog. There's different plugins that you can add onto your blog to create even additional sources of revenue. There's so much here that is available for you in the blogging system. Uh, I don't even have enough time to cover everything. I just wanted to, to cover the, the main features and main things that you're gonna be starting off using. Now, the next thing that you're going to get access to is some of these different income streams that we've created for you. So we have what we call as copy and paste marketing campaigns. So these are income streams. Now, uh, what I have done here for you here is I've gone ahead and I've created the videos. I've created the advertising campaigns. I've created the, the emails, the blog posts. Uh, wrote the text, wrote the articles, done everything for you, and that way was all that you have to do is copy and paste, copy, copy the codes and copy the blog post, put it on your blog, paste it, and then publish it, and it's all set and done for you, ready for you to start generating some some revenue from. Now, here here's the way that this works. Now, when you blog, uh, what that does is that generates traffic to your blog, right? What we have done here is we've created these advertising campaigns that go ahead and do the selling for you to help you to become self-sufficient with that, okay? Now, when I normally uh, create these systems for companies, if I'm doing it for a small company, uh, I might do it from anywhere from about three to $5,000, but if I'm doing it for big companies, anywhere from about fifteen dollars to $25,000 on average. So again, uh, what this does is basically turns your blog into like a vending machine type of selling system. You're blogging, that generates traffic, that traffic comes to your blogs, they go through the income sources and buy the different products and services that you will have available for you as you get started here. And so what we've done is we've put in anywhere from, uh, on a very small level, anywhere from about 10 to 18 hours 
per advertising campaign anytime we do something like this. Generally, we're gonna put in a lot more hours than that. So, like I said, it's all that you have to do is copy and paste it. It's all set and done for you in about 60 seconds. If you're brand new, if you've been doing this for a while, you might be able to do it in 20 or 30 seconds. Now, the next thing that we have available for you is our YouTube videos. And as you can see here, here's a, a picture of me and I was out at Delray Beach here in uh, Florida. It's just outside of Miami, Florida. And that's where I was making some of my YouTube videos. Now, to my knowledge, this is the first time ever that this has been made available. And so what we have done is we've provided you the thousands of, of our YouTube videos that you can take those videos, put those onto your blog, and, and as again, is all that you have to do is copy and paste it, and that way you can earn the advertising revenue from it. So, you know when you go to YouTube and you watch a, a YouTube video and that little commercial that plays? Well, there's revenue that is generated from that. Then in the video itself, there's little ads that, that people can click on, and anytime clicks on those, you will also get paid for that as well. So, you don't have to actually go ahead and film the videos. We've already done this for you. You can take our YouTube videos, post them on your blogs and that way you can generate some advertising revenue from there. Now if you don't want to go ahead and do this stuff yourself, what we have for you is we have different experts that will go ahead and do the blogging, do everything that we've talked about for you and that way you don't have to. Now again we do suggest to you that you do do it but you don't always have to. You can outsource this and, and have our different experts do this for you. Now the reason that we can do this for five bucks per project is because instead of paying for on an hourly basis, which is what most companies do and they charge a lot of money for services like this, what we're able to do is we found independent contractors and what they're, what they're doing is they're doing this on a per project basis. Now you can get started today. On a, with your blogging system on a monthly basis for only $7.16 per month or you can buy the whole year up front. You can get started for the whole year up front for only $66.72 and if you do it for the year you're able to save a lot of money with that. And once you get started here what that's going to enable you to do that's finally going to enable you to qualify for this governmental stimulus program. So immediately you're gonna be able to start saving that $2,000 to $10,000 every year, but in about three weeks or so, uh, once you submit everything and once we get everything started, you're gonna be able to see an extra three to $500 per month added onto your paycheck from your job through a series of governmental stimulus programs. So what you're gonna do is if you look down on the page below, you're gonna click on the link and it's gonna take you to a page like what you see here. So you're just gonna scroll down the page just a little bit uh, and it says uh, getting started now. So we're gonna go ahead and click on that. It's gonna take you to this alternative page. Let's just wait for it to load up and then you choose a plan. So we'll scroll down the page here. And if you do it for the year, um, which is 556 a month. So like I said, you're gonna be able to save a lot of money by doing it that way. Or you can even buy it for three years if you want, which is 396 a month. Or if you can do it monthly for only 716. So let's go ahead and select sign up now. Now I know you may not understand everything that you get here, but the best way to truly understand what we have provided here for you here today is to put it to the test. Wouldn't it be a shame if you lost $3,600 all the way up to $6,000 from lost governmental stimulus checks? Or wouldn't it be a shame if you had to spend an extra $2,000 to $10,000 on your normal everyday expenses that you would have been able to save by getting started with this governmental stimulus program? Money that you could have kept in your pocket. So the best way to truly understand what you get here with us is to pull out your credit card and select one of the options down below. And within about three weeks, you'll receive another three to $500 per month added onto your paycheck from your job through this series of governmental stimulus programs. One more thing, stay healthy. I'm glad I could help you, and we'll see you in our next video. Now, do not miss out on our next video where you see a video with Oprah Winfrey where she interviewed a gentleman by the name of Paul Rogers who was making about $48,000 a year. But because of this governmental stimulus program, he added an extra $300 per month added to his paycheck from his job at the fire department. So don't miss out on that video. Again, look down on the page below, select the best option for you, pull out your credit card and get started, and then move on to our very next video. Stay healthy, have a great day, I'm glad I could help you and we'll talk with you shortly. Bye bye now.